Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be um, what's in my skincare box and I'm going to rate them out of 10. So yeah, let's dig in because there's a lot here. So these are the pads that I use. Um, this is them. These are really good. Um, I rate these out of the 10 to be fair because they're really good. I got these from Savers. I think you get like a free pack, but I didn't realise that, so I bought loads. Then I got cotton pads for my eyes. I don't really use them that much. So let's go to... Okay, so when I take my makeup on, I use this micellar water to take off the makeup. This, I do really like. I use this all the time. So I'll write this out of a 10. Then... We've got two cleansers. Oh no, we missed one. So this is the eye makeup remover. This is the Nivea Glam, the glow one. This is you the two splits and then you try it and it turns into one. This I do really like. So yeah, this is a 125ml. Love this. That is a 10. So I do like it to be fair. Then let's move on to cleansers. So the one that I've been was using before is the uh, Pacifica Sea Foam Complete Facial Wash. Removes makeup, cleanses and tones. There's coconut oil and sea complex in it. It's um, powerhouse antioxidant, all skin types, sulfate free, 100% vegan and cruelty free. This I loved. Um, I used to use this with my Clever Sonic. Um, but I have actually went out, so I need to get some more of that. Then, we got another cleanser. This is the, this is it. I'm not going to say the name because I'll probably butcher it. This is the oil skin cleanser. So, for oily and combinated skin, removes excess oil without drying. Gently foaming at action. Sulfate free. So, yeah, so I do really like this. This is a 10 as well. And I don't know if I remember saying, but this is a 10 as well. Did really like it and I like this as well. All I do is I squirt a few pumps on my Clever Sonic, um, dampen my face before I do, and then just exfoliate it round. Then we got brushes for masks and that lot. To be fair, you can get any matte brush you want. Now we're just going to tools. So to use them, I use my Clever Sonic. This I do actually really, really like. Um, I want to get the mask one as well. But this one's really good. Next, I'm going to move on to my AHA, my AHA and BHA. So this is it. This is new. Um, it's basically just like a red um, face. I'll say it's kind of like a face mask. Because you leave it on for 10, sec 10 minutes. And then you wash it off. I do really like that. I am trying to use it regularly, but I keep forgetting to. So, yeah, um, I'll keep you updated on this. Then I've got my vitamin spray. This is from the body shop. I do really like this. I spray this on my face every day. Um, so, yeah, I certainly spray it on my face after I use this. So, then next we've got the Drops of Youth. This is from the body shop as well. Youth Conservative. Con you know what I mean? So yeah, I use this. I do really like this as well. As you can tell, I've nearly finished it. Um, it's basically just a clear liquid. Well, clear kind of liquid. You just put it all over. That is a 10 as well. Um, the vitamin spray as well is a 10. Because, you know, I've not really seen a difference, to be fair, but... Not really seen a difference, but you know. Then we have another brush for face masks. Then we have razors for when I do um raising thing. And then I have this rolling kind of thing for under the eye. So I do like that. Let me just put this away because this has lip balms. So I have um, 
bamboo cotton buds. Um, I do want to try and find cotton buds that you can reuse, but at the minute we're going to use that one. So then I have two face masks. These are my favourite ones. So we have the British Rose Fresh Plumping Mask. So this is it. Um, let me show you what it's like on the inside. So um, this is from the Body Shop. I do like their masks. Their masks are really good. Oh shoot. So basically it's just like that. It is really nice. And it smells lovely. So I like that one. It smells amazing. And then you've got the next one, which is the um, Clay Mask Puffing Glow Mask. Purifying. Sorry. So this is basically just like a mud mask. So it's just like a mud mask. Really good. I do love it. So them are a 10 out of 10 because I love them. They're so nice. So then you got the um, best damn beauty, best damn beauty oil. Hydrates an even skin tone. Um, to be fair, this breaks me out more than anything. Um, the only reason why I keep it for it is when I'm doing the shaving thing, I put this on beforehand and then shave. So this does break me out, but I only use this for when I'm shaving my face. This is probably like a five out, 5 out of 10. If it wasn't for the fact it breaks me out, then I wouldn't really have a problem with it. But, you know, it's one of them. So then we've got the Best Damn Beauty Facial Mask. Supercharging Sleeping Mask. Um, it's just um, a clear consistency. Now, this is really heavy for me. So what I do is, when my face needs that extra bit of plumpness... I will wear put this on on the night and then sleep with it on and then in the morning I will then just cleanse my face so I give this about probably about a seven or an eight because it's not a product I would use every day because it's too thick for my skin for everyday use and um, this is why I only use it on the night because it's not that sort of consistency where you can use it in the day. So, yeah. Now, in here, we have all my other face masks. So, this bag, I can't remember where I got this bag from. So, we have some face masks that I'll put in pots. Oh, I lost one. can't remember what ones I'm on. Then we have this um, calming pink clay mask. I do really like this. I like the clay masks it makes your face feel nice that one i do like um and then we have this one this is the formulation 1006 pore b pore pure skin clarifying mud mask this i do like as well um but i think this is out of date now yeah so i'm gonna have to get another one of that and then in here we have we have a tea tree, we have some tea tree um, deep cleansing nose pore strips. I do like nose pore strips because I get a lot of blackheads on my nose um, and then a buggy to get out so I always use that. Then we have a blackhead killer, this is a peel off mask. Um, to be fair, I used this and I didn't really like it that much um i didn't see a difference or anything so yeah then we have um a glitter mask this is the cubel professional illuminating hieroglyphic peel off mask contains violet and jasmine extracts I do really like this. Um, I've not used it yet because um, it's got glittering and I don't like losing, using face masks that have got glittering because, I don't know, I just love face masks with glittering and I feel like, I feel upset if I have to use it because it's so nice. 
it look it's more it's not for more treating your skin it's more for like instagrammable looks where people use the gold and pink um face masks so that's what this was for then we've got the seven heavens i love the seven heaven face masks so i've got the red hot earth one this is for normal to dry skin warms and unclogged pores self-heating treatment then we've got the red hat red hot sazun sazuna declog uh, declogs your skin gently warm mask this is for normal to combination dry skin then we have the passion peel off this is for normal to oily and combination skin removes unwanted oils and protect easy peel off mask then we have the Dead Sea Mud Mask. This is for normal, combinated and oily skin. Dead Sea, ooh, Dead Sea, Dead Sea Mineral Rich. So yeah, so Seven Heaven face masks are brilliant. So if you look, if the Body Shop ones are a bit too dear for you because I'm like 30 summer, then Seven Heaven are the second best. They are brilliant. And that's pretty much that's all in my ma mask book, but, uh, bag. Can't even talk. I'm gonna keep one of these um, poor things out actually because I'm gonna use it. What do I need to put the pink hair on in? So that's all in my mask book bag. Then we have my lip balms. Now I have a lot of lip balms as you can tell. I have Vaseline which is the original, the rose lips. I have the green one which is um I think it's tea tree not tea tree, um aloe vera. I have the brown one which is cocoa. I have um I also have the red one which is um what's the red one now? There's something in the red one. I have EOS balms. I have birds bees. I have um, baby lips. I have Clemex. I have a lot of lip balms in here. Like a lot. So I'll probably just show you a few of them. So I have the EOS ones. I love these ones. I have the Vaseline, which is the original. I have, this is the one that I was on about, the Paint the Town Red Lip Tint. Um, where's the one gone? I have the green one for Vaseline, which is aloe vera. Um, I also have another lip EOS lip balm. I have loads of EOS lip balms, I love them. Then I have um, another lip balm, which is rose lip. Um, then I have Bird's Bees, which this one has like a ready tint to it. Put them down there. I have Nivea. This one is the Pearl Shine Lip Balm. Then I have another Nivea Lip Balm, but this is um, a lip scrub. I have another EOS Lip Balm, another EOS Lip Balm, another EOS Lip Balm. Then I have the... Then I have the baby lips. I have four. I have um, sugar cookie. That's sugar cookie. It's like a pale pink. I have, um, what's this one called? Hydrate, which is just, I think, the original. Then I have the 23 Chow Tea Latte, which is like a dark red. Then I have the... Peach Kiss, which is like a peachy colour. Then I have, um, what's this one? 19 Blueberry, and it's just like a blueberry colour. Then I have ones I love around myself, which I don't know why. That one's not. This one is um, lip, gloss, lip Gloss. Oh, this is a lip gloss. Love Hearts. So that needs to go back in my lip gloss one. This is a lip gloss as well. Then I have another 
Vaseline. This is the blue one. I've got two of them. I have another Nivea one. This is the Pearl Shine. Then I have, oh, I've got another Baby Lips, which is Sweet Apple. And it's just like a red colour. Then I have Clemex. This is a cherry one. I have another Clemex. This is the Moisturiser in pink. What else do I have? I have um, another Nivea Pearl Shine Lip Balm. I have two more EOS Balms. Then I have another... No, this is... I think this is... There's only one of these. So this is a Vaseline Cocoa Butter one. Um, and then I have... Oh, I've got another Baby Lips in Vanilla Cupcake. Then I have two more Bird's Bees. This one is a tinted lip balm. And then this one is the original. Then what else have in here? And then I have another Nivea Soft Rose lip balm. And then these are just some ones that I've had. This is the Avon Cool Tend Pink Diamond. So like that. This is the Colour Tend in Strawberry. Um colour tend in chocolate brownie don't really like them colour tend in white chocolate don't like them and this one is just a normal lip balm then we have a normal lip um colour tend in um i think it's vanilla co and then i have a love art one which is really good i have one i think this is one that i made and then what's in this one? I think this is one that I've made as well. Yep. So the ones that I made, I'm probably going to put in the bin because I think they're leaking. Like, I also have a big one, but like, I don't know. Yeah. can go in the bin as well. So smell that nice. The ones that I'm okay, I will like keep out. So the, e the e EOS ones are brilliant. I love these. They are literally brilliant. I have a lot of them. Then the Vaseline ones. These are brilliant. All these ones. I love them. They are my favourite. Well, to be fair, the EOS, the Vaseline, and then the Nivea ones are my favourite as well. Um, The Baby Lips are my favourite. So the Baby Lips are 10 out of 10. The Vaseline is 10 out of 10. The Nivea ones are 10 out of 10. The EOS are 10 out of 10. Um, the Climax ones are 10 out of 10 as well. I love them. They're literally brilliant. You can have different ones for like different colours. And then the Bird's Bees, these are really, really good. I do like them as well. So they're 10 out of 10 as well. Um, the Heart is probably about 5 or something because I haven't really used it. Then I've got this Raspberry Lip Balm. I've only used a couple of times. Oh, I'll call them and get it out. Yeah, I've only used it a couple of times. Not, It's 5 out of 10. Then this Colour Trend one is... Mm, yeah, that's good. It's. The, I'm going to say about a 7 or an 8 because... With this one, you have like that clay kind of feel. And I don't really like it. To be fair, these ones I'll probably give away. Oh, hold on a minute. Not that one. That's soon. These ones I'll probably give away because I don't really use them. This has got to give my lip, balm, lip gloss. And then I think this is a lip balm that I made. So I'll probably keep that one because that one's all right. Oh, I've got another baby lips, I don't really know. So, yeah, I'm going to keep these two lip balms out so I can start using them because now that the heat's come, I need to stop protecting me. So, that's them. Then, in here, I have this moisturising coral foot pack with um, shea butter in. It's one treatment for 20 minutes. I haven't really tried it yet, but I think I'm going to try that today. Then, here, we have the um, bubble with glossy box. And your dust foaming bath powder. This, do you remember when I had um, that glossy box and it was the Angel versus Devil 
this was in that and then i've also just realized i've got another lip scrub here as well so this needs to go in here i have a lot of lip scrubs and then the last thing in here is my shaver which it shouldn't be in there let me just empty that out because it's got all dog hair in so yeah so that is pretty much everything that is in this box um i think i might need to get a bigger box because i don't think everything's gonna fit in but we'll see so let's see if it fit in so my two makeup ones i've put here first then i've put my cleanser then i've put my um one there and then that there so then the face mask can go in here no oh, that's that's fine then it's fitting so there then this needs to go down the side and then this needs to go down this side shavers and this lot can go in here obviously because obviously that's to do with my face And then this beauty oil can go in there. That can stay out. Them two can stay out. And then I just need to put the brushes away. Just put them on top to be fair because, you know. So then let's just put the babu ones here. And these can go on top. And then that's pretty much it. So yeah, so that is everything that is in my skincare box. Um, I have a lot of stuff in my skincare routine, um, as you've seen. But yeah, some of the stuff is really, really good. Some of it isn't. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see any more, don't forget to subscribe, click, notific not click the notification bell to be notified every time I upload. Don't forget to... Um, comment your favorite vid your favorite ugh. comment your feedback and comment any of the videos that you want to see um social media links will be down below um yeah and i will see you in wednesday's video bye guys